As you might already know, Lambda Test supports over 120 plus integrations with different bug marking tools, project management tools, communication channels, CICD tools, and codeless automation tools. Today, let's talk about how easy is it to integrate with a codeless automation tool Catalon and run your tests directly from Catalon to Lambda Test. So you might already know, so Catalon is a codeless automation tool which allows you to record your scripts directly by just entering in your web URL and then using the Catalon recorder, you can record all of the actions and then later play the recording to execute your scripts. Here, as you see on my screen, is a recorded script that I have where I'm just simply opening the Lambda test website, logging in and logging out of it. Let me first showcase how easy is it to run this on a local browser. So here, as soon as I click on this play icon, you can see that the test has started running on my local Chrome. And in a couple of seconds, you'll see a Chrome window popping up where you'll see the complete execution of the test. So this has now open Lambda test, it's logging in, and it will now log me out to complete the test session. Now, I would like to run the same test case, but this time I would like to leverage the Lambda test inventory how I can do that. To integrate Catalon with Lambda test, you simply need to go into project and project, click on settings. Under settings, just go into desired capabilities and click on remote. Under remote, you'll have to configure both the Lambda test hub URL along with the username and access key as well as the capabilities. You might already know from where you can get the uh, Lambda test hub URL that is go into the Lambda test automation dashboard and it's on the top right under the access key icon, which will just load up. You can just click and you can copy this first link, which says hub, and right? you can paste it here in the remote URL. And then you'll have to add each and every capability that you want to run the test on. So for any of the tests to run, you might already know that the basic capabilities are the browser platform your version that you need. And on top of it, you can also add so other capabilities like name or build. And how easy is it to add? Just click on add, enter the name of the property. So let's say I want a network log, so I'll write network and I'll change it to Boolean and other value to true. And from where you can get all of the capabilities that Lambda supports is from the Lambda test capabilities in later. So from here, under Selenium, you can select all of the capabilities that you require along with all of the different logs, test names, everything that you want, and you can add those capabilities under the desired capability object. Once you add all of this, the only thing you need to do is apply the changes, apply and close. Once that's done, under this drop down, you just need to click on remote, and you can see on the top right, the test case now has started running on the Lambda test URL. Now, if I go back to the automation dashboard, you can see on the top a few seconds ago, a new test has just started called test Catalon and the test has started running. And as you can see in the capabilities, I had selected Chrome 107, Windows 10, the test has started running there. It has also taken the names that I've added and the test has been completed. So this was how easy and quickly you can integrate your Catalon tests with Lambda test. In case you have any questions, please feel free to reach out to us at support at rate lambda.com.